Don't forget to clean out the lint trap when we get there. You guys forgot that shit last week. Don't fucking piss me off. For Christ's sakes, Pops. It's the morning. What's your language? That's a good one, Finn. Pops, what's his language? Never happen. All right, you two smart asses. Why don't you get out of here and get your work and your school done? And there's the Pops we all know and love. I'll see you later. Okay, all kidding aside, Pops. I'm going to be a little late to work. If that's okay. Yeah, sure. What the hell? You got something going on? You're not dating some weirdo again, are you? No, Pops, I'm not dating some weirdo. I just got something I gotta do. It's personal. But I screws the fuck out of me. I'm gonna go get to work. Give me a break, Pops. I'll see you later. Crazy bastard. Oh my god, Cassie. Did you sleep here all night? Ah, oh, shit, Oliver, why'd you let me sleep in? You know I got a presentation today. Yes, of course. I'm the one that let you sleep in. Although you've been drinking about six beers last night. By yourself. Yeah, Oliver, I get it. You're a fucking saint. Now, can I go get a shower? Call my boss, tell him I'm gonna be late. Oh, yes. Another day in paradise. Okay, Jackson, what's so important that you had to pull me before I go to work? I'm gonna be late. Hey, okay, well, I'm sorry about that, mate. But I've got a bit of a problem. My brother, he's gotten into a bit of trouble. I told him he could stay here. For a little while. Yeah, sure, no. Jax, that's fine. He's your brother. What happened? Yeah, well, you know, just the usual crap. Fell in with the wrong crowd. I've got to keep him on straight and air. Yeah, well, of course, Jax. You know, anything I can do to help. No, I really got to get to work before I'm late. Oh, shit. Yeah, yeah, you're right. I've got to cover for Finn. Come on, Finn, he's your best friend. You have to tell me when he's going to be here. Okay, look, Audrey, a tiny little stalker. I don't have to tell you shit. Besides, Oliver's not going to be interested in you. You're the wrong sex, for one. Right now, that's enough of that, you little brat. If you're not going to order something, get the hell out. I'm leaving for now, but I will be back. Jesus Christ, she's a little stalker, isn't she? Hell yeah, she's got the crazy eyes. Just like your grandmother. Come on, both seriously. Watch, make sure rest in pace. She's probably giving the devil a run for his money. Hey, what's a girl gotta do to get a beer around here? Oh, hey, Gacy. I'll get you a bean in just a minute. Hey, no rush, I can wait till your lunch break. You sorry, Casey, no can do. I'm meeting Valerie for lunch. Maybe next time. No problem, we'll catch up next time. Oh, handsome, what you doing? Here on my lunch break. Audrey, you know that. You've been stalking me for the last month. It's really getting weird. Oh, come on, Oliver. I wouldn't call it stalking. We are destined to be together. I'm just here to remind you of that. Tree, you do realize I'm gay. I'm not interested in you. I'm never going to be interested in you. Okay, fine. But you better tell Finn how you feel before it's too late. Finn, what are you talking about? Finn is my best friend. I'm not... I don't like Finn. He's not my type and I'm not his. Yeah, sure you don't. You just keep coming here every day for lunch by yourself. Who's the stalker now? Later. I'm certainly not a stalker. Not a stalker, am I? Hey, Oliver. Are you okay? Do I just say something? Look like you've seen a ghost. No, I'm fine. I'm fine. It, she doesn't bother me. I have to get back to work. Uh, we'll talk later. Hell, that was just word. So, don't you worry. For now, you've got me all to yourself. Hmm, now I like the sound of that. Yeah, I'm going to have to enjoy this peace and quiet while I can. Lachlan, Jackson's little brother, is going to be staying with us for a while. I guess we better make the most of it then. Yes, we absolutely better. We should take this to the bedroom. Yes, we should. I got here as soon as I got your message. Why are you here so late? Where's Pops? I don't know what else to do. I can't go home. This is a nightmare. You put us down for this. Okay, Finn. Now you've got me officially freaked out. What's going on? Hell, I don't even know where to begin. I've been having some issues. And I went to see the doctor. They ran some tests. And I got my answer today. And I don't know how to break it, Pops. Wait a minute, Finn. I don't understand. Tests. 
What's wrong? What is it? It's cancer, Oliver. I've got cancer. Same kind that killed my dad. How the hell do I tell Pops? Oh my God, Finn. I'm so sorry. I'm here for you. You know that. Always. Whatever you need. I know that, Oliver. You're my best friend. I don't know what I'd do without you. All right, boy, oh, you got us all here. You're scaring the shit out of me. What's going on? Oh, I'm scaring you, Pops, and I'm sorry. But I have to tell you, I saw the doctor today. That's where I went on my personal business. What the hell are you seeing a doctor for? To give it to me straight. What is it? I've been having pain for a while in my abdomen. About two weeks. I didn't want you to worry till I was sure. They did tests. They found a tumour in my liver. It's cancer, Pops. Oh, baby, I'm so sorry. We're here for you. Anything you need. Cancer. Can't be cancer. Damn it! I'm not going to let it take another one of my family. Son of a bitch! Pops, please calm down. Remember your blood pressure. Fuck my goddamn blood pressure. We're more worried about you. Pops, please take it easy. I need you to be strong for me. Her son. Of course I'm going to be strong for you. I'm not going to lose another one to this. You know I love you, boy. I love you too, Pops. Well, hey there, my sexy boyfriend. You come to take me out to dinner? Yeah, that was the plan. But something's come up. We go to go to a big dinner. It's important. It's about fame. Okay, is everything all right? I don't know. All of it ain't make it sound too good on the phone. Okay, then let me grab my purse and we'll go. <sighs> oh. What? Alan, what are you doing in my bedroom? Well, that's easily answered, silly. I'm in your dream, and I'm here to do whatever you want me to do. Damn, I'm liking where this dream's going. How about you get on out of that bed and we get in the shower? Oh, hell yeah. Man, wake up, it's breakfast. What are you having one of those sex dreams again? Jesus, fuck. Pops, what the hell? What are you doing in my room? Oh, excuse me, I'm invading your privacy now. Come on, get your breakfast. You're going to need your strength. Let's go. So, Casey, is this how you want to see me? I'll stay in New York for you. I'll do anything for you. Which will go to the outback for me. Oh yeah, Jax, I know you will. You need to dump that girlfriend of yours and come stay with me. Whatever you want me to do, Cassie. How about you give me a case? Oh yeah, absolutely, Jax. Cassie, wake up. You're going to be late for work again. Ah oh, shit, Oliver, why do you have to ruin such a good dream? Seriously, Cassie, it's the same dream you have every night. Now come on, I really wish you'd stop talking in your sleep. Yeah, well you should totally stop listening. Hey, Finn, so I need a favor. I'm going to be bringing my brother by, and I just want to introduce you, since you are one of my best friends, if that's okay. Ah, sure, no problem. That's fine, Dylan. It's fine. Finn, are you sure you're okay? You look a little tired. Oh, yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'll, I'll see you later tonight. Boy, when are you going to tell them what's going on? Don't you worry, Pops. I'm telling everybody tonight. All right, come on, let's get back to work. Yeah, well, I just want to say thank you again, Rayla, for agreeing to help me. I know you don't necessarily like jokes, but I'll go to pass if I want to play. Flynn, that's not necessarily true. I want to help you. Okay, well, cool. Is it okay if I ask you out? Yeah, I was hoping that you would. Well, son, have you had a chance to look over those proposals I gave you on the next case? Yes, I did, Father, and it's a great case. We're going to win it for sure. Yes, of course we are, son. Uh, I will see you at dinner tonight. I'm sorry, Father, I can't have dinner tonight. I'm meeting the guys. Of course you are, son. Perhaps lunch tomorrow? Yes, of course, Father, I can do lunch tomorrow. Very good. Well, carry on. Hey, I'm Oliver. I hope you don't think I'm too forward, but I'd like to ask you out on a date. Oh, um, James, I'm flattered. Really, but can I think about it? I don't mean to be rude, but I've got a lot on my mind. Oh, yeah, of course, that's fine. Take all the time you need. Okay, Lachlan, you're staying here, 
but you've got to respect the rules, because I'm not the only one who lives here. You got it? Here for Christ's sake, Jakes. I'm not five. I understand. Key Lachlan, first of all, lose the attitude. And I got you a part-time job. You're going to earn your keep. You're going to be working with me at Pops. Okay, yeah, fine, I'll get it. Can I go now? Yeah, fine, you can go. We'll see each other tonight for dinner. Oh, bro, how have you been? I mean, I haven't heard from you in, like, forever. What's been going on? You know, bro, the usual, this and that. You know, traveling. Mostly traveling. So, what's up with you? Yeah, I forgot the glamorous life of a photographer. No, everything's going great. The design firm's great. Tanya's amazing. So, okay, I get it. Speaking of amazing, who is the hottie at the bar? What, you mean Finn? Yeah, he's one of my best friends. Please tell me he is not one of your straight friends. No, he's not, and I was going to introduce you. Well, okay, then. Okay, well, everything's ready to go to the printers, so I'm going to leave you to it. I'm going to go. I'm ready, Finn. Ah, oh, hello to your tour, Cassie. I didn't mean to rush you. Well, damn, Cassie, who is this? I'm Austin, by the way. Please, Austin, as if I'd ever introduce you to any of my gay friends. Let's go, Finn. Ow, damn, girl. Oh, my goodness, Finnegan. Talk to me, baby. Oh, my God, Pops, what happened? Damn it, this is all my fault. I put all the stress on him. Stress? What the hell are you talking about, Finn? Flynn, I didn't want to have to tell you like this. I was going to tell you at dinner tonight. I've got cancer. Like that. Cancer? What the fuck, Finn? Why didn't you tell me before? Honestly, kiddo, I don't know how the hell I was going to tell any of you. But we've got to worry about Pops now, not me.